Simulation training is increasingly important for learning complex, high-risk skills such as endovascular neurosurgery. This endovascular neurosurgery simulator protocol tests trainees' anatomical knowledge and provides haptic catheter system feedback in a consequence-free environment. Our protocol includes stepwise guidelines for trainees of varying levels, which incorporates didactic instruction as well as a discussion of the advantages and limitations of this model. Demonstrating the procedure will be Robert Rennert, a neurosurgery resident and former endovascular neurosurgery fellow. Before beginning a procedure, assemble and power on the simulator. Select the patient scenario in the software interface on the attached laptop and select the appropriate arterial sheath size from the drop-down menu. Select the appropriate catheter, guide wire, and or microsystem based on the specific scenario and turn on the A and B plane. Activate the fluoroscopy with the foot pedals and use the joysticks to adjust both the patient and image intensifier positions until the correct posterior anterior and lateral views are obtained. For a four-vessel cerebral angiogram simulation, select a 5 French femoral sheath, a 0.035-inch guide wire, and a 5 French diagnostic catheter from the drop-down menu as tools to be used in this simulation. Insert the guide wire into the simulator machine until it registers on the simulation screen, signaling that access has been gained. Advance the guide wire until it is visualized in the descending thoracic aorta and continues into the aortic arch. 